As per usual, we are unboxing the newest crate added to Team Fortress 2 with Smithsmus 2021. And that is, of course, the Smithsmus 2021 cosmetic case. No wall paints added this update, as we know. But I'm here. I'm in my Smithsmus sweater, sort of. And yeah, we're going to get into it. I've got 10, 10 of these cases to unbox. I'd like to thank Manco.store for providing me with five of these cases. Very cool. You saved me some money. Love that. And if one of them is unusual, you'll have made me some money. And I'd also like to thank Altacalls for nominating me to receive these cases. So, big up. Anyway, we're here with these 10 wonderful cases, hoping to get an elusive, unusual, or an unusual fire. I've seen many people having unbox look notched on these cases, but on any case that they unbox. So, I'm hoping some of that rubs off on me. Uh, and I can get a nice unusual. Alright, we're gonna we're just gonna jump into it with the first case. If we get something here, the video's done. I'm just gonna cut it. We did get the Mushanka though, which is my favourite cosmetic from the case, which is good. We didn't get that last time, so it's always nice to have. A very cool heavy hat, actually. Big fan. I might um might start using it on some other loadouts. Box number two, or case number two, it's not really a box, is it? Two items, I think. Okay, we got we got the Merry Cone and a Festivizer. We we already saw it. But yeah, a Festivizer, lovely stuff. This is a uh, one I think this might be one of the highest grades I've actually unboxed on video. I'm not sure cuz it kind of took me back the um the color of this is a pink. Um I didn't expect that. We got the Merry Cone, very nice. And moving swiftly on to number 3. Um two items again. Hopefully it doesn't spoil it this time. Ooh, we got the Festive Frames. And tour duty ticket, lovely. I do love some MVM, so that is perfectly fine with me. We'll just whack them in here. Festive frames actually look pretty cool. Like that's that's a that's a cool model for a hat. Well, I I think it's pretty cool at least. Um, well, we number four. We are thundering through these. Um, but what do we get? We get a festivizer. Okay, and unusual. No, we are the El Fiesti Brero. I'm telling you, my unusual look, these recent um, unboxings have not been the best. Um, but so far, no duplicates from my last unboxing, which is very good. So far, I think the Mushanka is the best thing I've unboxed. But Toradu ticket is always nice. I do enjoy a bit of MVM. And anyway, we're on to... We're halfway through, actually. So uh, let's just see what we get. Come on. Give me something good. Come on, unusual or not. Uh, elf. Another elf cosmetic for the, the, the collection. Every year we get elf cosmetics and this is this is another one. Another elf scout can happen. We have the we had the like the toy soldier elf, I think. Or the toy soldier soldier. We had the other elf el scout and now we have this elf scout. So there's like two elf scouts going on. You can probably combine them to create the ultimate elf if you wanted. Um, but we're just gonna go on to number six. Get away from this elf thing. <laughs> oh, we got the rain dune rain rain dune horns. Uh, I don't know. I'm not feeling these rain these rain the. I'm not feeling the rain dune corn cosmetics because we get one every year now. It's kind of getting old. You're going to run out of ideas eventually, guys. Come on. I mean, we got that really odd. Pyro mask that one year is is quite odd. That's all I can really say. It's very odd. Completely their choice, but personally, not for me. And on to box number seven, we get a Manco ticket, and we get a cozy catchers. All right, another headband cosmetic. I don't know why we're getting so many headband cosmetics. All right, please, <laughs> please. We got one in the last case, I believe. We got we got. We got some of the last winter case. We're getting loads of um, headband cosmetics. Uh, on to number eight, is this? Yeah, this is eight. And it's the elf defense. We now have the soldier elf to go with the toy soldier cosmetic. I, I actually might work pretty well, to be fair. Uh, they're both on similar vibes. Um, but this is actually a pretty pretty decent elf cosmetic because it has the, the green camo built into the elf hat. Which is a nice touch because soldiers wear camouflage. <laughs> uh, number nine. Still no unusual yet. And we get 
a strange seasonal spring. I guess it's, it's strange at least. Well, we've I think we've almost got all the blues. If not, we have all the blues. I my my colours. I'm not great. I think we have all the blues. If I'm not mistaken, and we've unboxed about 19 cases. So that's not good odds. The it's everything. Everything is on this last case. Will it be the fabled unusual? Ideally, a Mushanka unusual. But I'm not picky. I'll take any unusual at this point. Especially a taunt unusual of fire. Because that'd be dope. We shall see what I get from this fabled box. I'm going to close my eyes. Come on. Daddy wants an unusual. Okay, we get a Festivizer. Alright, and my eyes goes again. Gnome Dome. Not unusual. Sad. Uh, at least I didn't pay for half of these cases, I guess. Not the greatest of unboxings. Um, Manco.store, this is all your fault. <laughs> no, I'm very thankful that you actually sent me these five cases and keys um, to unbox. There was an unusual inside them, though. You couldn't, you couldn't like done like an under the table handshake, you know, a guaranteed unusual unbox. Come on, guys, come on, amateur hour. Uh, I do like the Mushanka though. I'm very happy I did get that. Just look at that. What a what a fucking sick cosmetic. You pair that with like a fucking a fucking Cuban Bristol crisis, and you're in the money. Yeah, look at that. See, epic. I think it's a very cool cosmetic. Big fan. Um, I'm glad I unboxed it. Not so glad about everything else. Uh, these festive frames are pretty dope. Look at that. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Um, but yeah, there's a, there's a zombie next to a Christmas tree. That was another failed unboxing. And no unusuals. Nothing. Right, I, can aff I have one more case. I can afford a key. We, we tried to bait out Valve with that being the last case. This is actually going to be the last case, alright? We're going to see... Will they give us an unusual? Oh, okay. A strange count transfer tool. Pretty dope. I'm going to close my eyes now. A strange Mushanka. Okay, that is actually dope. That actually worked out very well. Because I am going to use the Mushanka. So, having a strange one is even better. That's actually kind of dope. I guess it wasn't all bad. We got the strange hat we wanted. Shame it's not an unusual. That's about all the good I have to say from this case. I don't think I'm going to unbox any more of these because I'm not really the biggest fan of the items you can get. You've, you've heard me say it when the update first came out, and I'm just going to reiterate it here. Don't think they're that great. That's not to par any of the item creators that got their stuff in the game because that is a huge feat, um, and I'm, I'm happy for them. But personally, I'm not really their biggest fan. But that doesn't mean someone isn't. So, if you would, please do leave a like on the video for my suffering, if nothing else. And subscribe down below for more epic gaming content. I know my last video wasn't TF2 when I said it would be, but it had TF2 YouTubes in it, so it kind of worked out in the end. Uh, please go watch that if you haven't already. It was Crab Game, it was a load of fun. <laughs> Cheers, Rubber Mango, and peace. Hey, oh, uh. Uh, I've been up for like two hours. Two hours. Yo, bitch can food took a few showers. Few showers. I don't buy my just money dance. Yeah. That wristwatch costs a hundred grand. I